Hey guys, what's up? Lewin here at GarageBand and beyond. Welcome back. Today, I wanted to give you guys another little tip on how to customize the tone on your electric guitar for totally free. A couple of simple little adjustments you can do. Um, and it's primarily, I'm going to be talking about changing the height of the pickups uh, on your electric guitar. Today, I'm using my Strat as the example, but this will work for pretty much all Fenders any electric guitar that has adjustable height pickups. And you can usually tell by a set of screws on either side of the pickup, meaning you know there's an adjustment screw here and another one over here on the low end of the guitar. Um, so the only real thing you have to be careful of is on the low side, um, you don't want the pickup to be too close to the string. When it is too close, you will get in, uh, intonation problems, um, all sorts of problems, tonal issues. It's just sort of an ugly thing. If you find that that's what's happening, you're too close. That being said, there are a couple of measurements that you can use as sort of a, a limit um, if you'd like. So what I do is, and what everybody tells you to do, is to fret on the end of the fretboard like this. And then what you would do is actually measure between the bottom of the string and the top of the pole itself. Um, and so on the low side, the minimum measurement is an eighth of an inch. And on the high end, uh, the minimum is a sixteenth of an inch. Now, like I said, you can do this with a ruler, um, but I personally like doing it by ear. I think, you know, everybody's amp is a little bit different. Everybody's, you know, string gauges. And there's so many different components to what makes up your tone that I think it makes a lot more sense to do this adjustment by ear. But having a couple of things in mind, um, meaning, you know, like you want to make sure that the high end of all the pickups and the low ends are relatively matched because you don't want a big volume difference as you're switching through. Now the only thing that you really need to do this with is a Phillips head screwdriver. Nothing too complicated. You know, you put the screwdriver in the screw. When you turn it to the left, it will go down. And when you turn it to the right, it will go up. It's pretty pretty simple thing to do. Um, and yeah, you know, plug plug your guitar into your amplifier, your headphones, or whatever you use uh, every time you play your electric guitar, something that you trust, a sound source that you trust. And then just sit there and then make those adjustments and listen to the tone. You know, the closer you get the pickups to the strings, the more output you're really going to get because you're giving the pickups more material to grab onto, much like, um, you know, even beefing up your string gauge does the same kind of thing. But without changing your string gauge, this is a great way to beef up either the high end or the low end on your own electric guitar. So Phillips head screwdriver, a ruler, if you have it, is a nice thing to use, you know, just to sort of be careful of that one eighth and one sixteenth of an inch mark points. Um, but otherwise, really simple thing to do. Go play with your guitar. Like I said, you can't, oh, I didn't actually say it in this particular version, but you, you know, there's, <laughs> there's few um, adjustments on your guitars that you can do where you're really going to do permanent damage. I mean, you know, don't crank anything all the way to the maximum or the minimum. You know, remember, it's like half a turn at a time. Sometimes a quarter of a turn of a screw will make a gigantic difference. Um, so little things at a time. Be slow, be careful, use your ears properly. And, you know, especially in this, you definitely want to make sure that the volume is nice and even through all five positions on whatever, you know, on my Strat. I want to make sure all five positions on a Tele, all three. Just want to make sure that they're all nice and even. Uh, so that's pretty much it. Have fun. Go grab a screwdriver and have fun with your electric guitar. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Please subscribe to my channel and uh, then you can, you know, get alerts all the time because I put out videos a lot. So uh, that's it. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye. Hey guys, what's up? Lewin here at GarageBand and beyond. Welcome back. So today I was going to give you guys a little piece of, uh, you know, little piece of advice. I don't know. Um, on my Strat here, well this sucks. Measurements uh, are from the bottom of the string. This sucks. A little bit different. The only thing you got to worry about. Bleh, 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 bleh.